I, I'm going to say no to this question. I, I wouldn't trade Zion. And there, there's a couple of reasons. Uh, first of all, I, I believe this giant Zion Williamson has the chance to be a, a generational talent. And when we've seen how good he is when he is available. And Stephen A is right for the second time in 30 minutes. And I can't believe he, he's, he's done this. A dead today clock today is right Monday. twice a day. I know. It's unbelievable. Uh, <laughs> look, he, he's never going to reach his full potential. And the Pelicans will never reach their full potential with him on the roster until the other part of it clicks. And, and by the other part of it, I mean the, the preparation, the training, the diet, the sleep, all the things that are required to then go play basketball. I spoke about this a few months ago did. When, he, when he was talking about his hamstring injury. He's like, all I want to do is play basketball. And that's great. I get it. You want to compete. You want to play. You want to do the thing you love to do. Guess what? There's a lot of other stuff that comes along with that. And so it's very rare. I, I was in the league 15 years. It's very rare that it clicks for a 22 or 23-year-old. I, I think what is different, in, 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 in specifically with Zion, is because of his frame, because of the amount of force that he plays with, he's going to have some injuries unless he slims down and gets down to 260, 265 like he was at Duke. Until he does that, I think this will continue. But let's give him time for it to click because he's that good. 